Okay, so I'm looking at the Aperture MC light. I've had this light for just a few days now, and I want to show you how it comes. So first off, it comes in this box, very nice box, very solid. When I got this, I was excited to see it. Inside the box comes, first off, the light itself. So this is what this light looks like. You're on the side. This is where you turn it on and adjust the light settings. This is where you can screw it onto some kind of tripod. And you can plug it in here, get some power. Let's turn on the light. Here I have some blue light. There's various adjustments you can do to change the color. By pressing this button down, this uh, wheelie thing, you press it down. Then you can start adjusting, let's see, it's a saturation. Let's see, that's, this is the U. And then I press down this wheelie thing, saturation. And then I can also press down the wheelie thing. And then it goes the intensity. So that's 100% and you can make it lighter. So this is the light itself. Turn it off. It also comes with this, uh, this bag. I suppose you could just like put that on your belt or something. I, I'm not sure if I'll ever use this bag. It's not for me. Then you also get some, uh, some Velcro strips to put on your light and then here's this power cord so yeah this is interesting the um this light's got a magnet a couple of pretty strong magnets so you could stick this thing against some kind of uh metal surface and then you can just suspend it and use it so this is the light when i first got it i've just used it a couple of times I plan to have an, uh, additional videos that talk more about this light and how well it works. You know, one thing I have noticed by just using this a couple of times, that during the day, particularly when I have all this, this ambient light here, this natural light, that this, uh, this light barely does anything. However, at night, when I get rid of all these lights, then you can see more of an impact. Like if I turn this thing on, let's say I change the color to like red, okay, red, reddish pink. And I change the intensity like really, really high. Okay, this is the maximum intensity. So, so you can see that doesn't really do do too much unless I have the light really close to me. This is when it's a very light room. It's obvious that there's tons of natural light in this room. However, we'll take a look at this thing at night in a future video and we'll see what kind of impact it has, which is a larger impact. So in any case, that's all I've got to say for today. And that's the end.